everyone and welcome back to my channel today we're gonna do just a little simple get ready with me it's a Sunday I have a few errands to run and just things to do around the house so I thought let's just sit down and do some makeup while we're at it so let's get into the video all right if you've been around for a minute you know I always start with these two I go in with the CEO glow from Sunday Riley and then just one pump of my CC cream. Okay, so I just mix the one pump of CC cream and then I mix it with one pump of the CEO Glow. And I'm telling you, it gives you the most flawless base ever. I got it from Jaclyn Hill, so shout out my girl. And this CC cream a little bit goes a very long way. So <laughs> just be prepared if you, if you use it. It's kind of a light to medium coverage, but it is definitely buildable and it's super lightweight, which is nice. And it has sunscreen in it. It has SPF 50 plus, which we need sunscreen, okay? Protect us. Okay, next I'm gonna take my Maybelline Fit Me concealer in the shade 55. And I just like to go in with two little dots on the side. And this is what I use for my cream contour. And then I'll go in with the pointy side of my beauty blender and just dab it until it's blended. And like I always say, it's gonna look crazy, but you have to trust the process. Okay, and then once that is all blended out, I will go in with my Maybelline Age Rewind and I use the shade 115. And I just, I just go under my eyes with this. I don't go all over the face like I probably should, but we're just gonna go under the eyes. Okay, once I'm all done with my concealer, I will go in with my Maybelline Fit Me powder. This is the loose setting powder. Um, you could go in with the pressed powder, but for this, I prefer the loose one. And then I'm gonna take the same beauty sponge and I'm gonna take the side that I did my foundation with and I'm just gonna dab it in here. And I'm going to start by going under my eyes and in my T-zone, and then I'll do the rest of my face still with the Beauty Blender. And once again, Jaclyn Hill, she knows what she's doing because this trick works magic. After I set my face with the Beauty Blender, I just take my e.l.f. powder brush and I dab just a little bit in the same powder and I go down my neck to make sure that everything is blended and even. I already did my brows off camera, so I'm just gonna brush through them just to make sure that they are all going in the right direction. I'm gonna go in with my e.l.f. bronzer palette, and I'm going to also use the Expert Face Brush from Real Techniques, and you guys know, we just dab in all the colors. <laughs> After my bronzer, I will go in with the same palette, but the blush palette, and I will also use my Morphe E4 brush. And again, I just go in all of them, dab off the excess, and go in. Okay, next I'm gonna go in with the Wet n Wild Mega Volume and Mega Length, and I go in with the volume on top, and then go over with the length to get out any clumps, and then I just go on the bottom with the length. Okay, and there is the mascara. Okay, and then my last step, I go in with the NYX Butter Glosses in the shade Sugar High. I put all over the lip, and then I go in with Fortune Cookie, and I put it over it, and it is the most perfect nude lip ever, okay? Ever. Okay, so here's Sugar High. Here is Fortune Cookie. Here is it once they're layered so cute i love it all right y'all well that is it for my little get ready with me it's the same thing i always do but i figured i would just jump on here and show you guys again um so i hope you enjoyed and i can't wait to see you guys in my next video bye guys